hello guys welcome back to my channel today we'll see how to use arcgis pro for line of sight or visibility uh, analysis so to perform line of sight analysis we need to have at least three layers the first one will be the observer's location layer again second one will be the target layer and uh, the third one will be the obstruction layer so here i have added my uh, three layers necessary layers into my arcgis pro and this layer has to be in the 3D data layer mode or in the 3 dimensional data uh, type. So you have to create your uh, necessary layers and add uh, into the 3D uh, data layers. So here I have a uh, point feature which is the observation point feature. Again, the second one is our target feature which in this case is one. And I have also the building fit footprints so uh, this observation location is the proposed security personnel location and uh, the second layer which is a uh, root one it is the uh, target layer in this case this is uh, the road line uh, across the city and uh, this is the city's buildings uh, so we are going to uh, determine which location along this route uh, can be uh, seen by the security personnel. So if it is required to locate the security camera or the security personnel in on these two location, so we are going to determine which uh, locations along this route or along this target route is visible or it can be seen by uh, security personnel. So the main advantage of this is visibility analysis in ArcGIS Pro is used to assign or to locate uh, the, the security personnel or the security uh, cameras. So you have to create your uh, layers in 3D data layer and they display in ArcGIS Pro 3D data layer type. So once you have created and added your data layer, you can use uh, line of sight analysis to determine uh, which areas are visible from certain points of observation so in this tutorial we will first try to perform two tasks the first one is determining line of sight for each of the uh, these two observation location first we will create the line of sight then we will determine visibility between observer support and the uh, target point which is a line uh, or the root <coughs> feature so First, we will uh, create a line or line of sight between each of observation point and the root just by taking the sampling or spacing sampling as certificates apart along the road. Then we will uh, check the visibility of uh, these uh, routes from the point of observation. So to create line of sight, first we have to use the construct line of sight 3D analysis in ArcGIS Pro. Just go to your processing or your processing tab and search for construct line of sight uh, 3D analysis tool. So uh, this 3D tool uh, creates a line feature that represents sight lines between one or more observation points and the feature in the target feature. So as I said, our target in this case is the root one and our observation point is the security personnel location. And they are going to determine which areas or which location along this road can be seen by this uh, security personnel. So as you can see, uh, the road goes to this direction and uh, we have buildings around this. So it is obvious that this road or this area is blocked by uh, these buildings. So we can just use uh, the line of sight analysis to perform uh, the visibility of this line from the two location of these personnel or uh, security personnel. So in this construct line uh, geo processing tab, you have to input your observer's point, in this case, the security personnel's location. So it will be the uh, point feature. Then our target feature is the uh, uh, root one. So select the root layer here. So it specifies the output name and the output location. So uh, you have to uh, select the Z information from the two uh, layers in the attribute table. So for the observation location, I have a shape of Z, which is the height of the observation point. Again, for the target, I have a field which is called as Z value. You have to specify these two parameters. 
then uh, for this tutorial i'm going to use the sampling distance of around 40 maybe yeah you can use uh, this is a spacing between the lines that is going to be created so we can use as 40 once you have specified your parameters you can just run the process so uh, after the tour runs uh, successfully the new site line is uh, added to the map as you can see here this is the line of sight so you can zoom in uh, into the line generated in the image which displays uh, many lines leading to the route so we will use uh, these site lines as input uh, line feature for the line of sight analysis so first we use uh, we have to create these lines using this construct line site as you can see this line shows uh, visibility of uh, this road from this point of observation point as you can see again this is these lines are created for this uh, observation point so this security personnel can see only uh, along this uh, line of sight uh, feature so by using this uh, line feature we can determine uh, the suitability or the visibility uh, lines analysis so <coughs> next we will determine the visibility uh, between the observation and the a route along each of the site line that we have uh, created here so uh, to do so just go back to this geoprocessing tab and uh, search for line of sight this one line of sight 3d analyze tool so this tool determines the visibility along sight line given terrain uh, which is represented by the input surface and the obstruction which are uh, represented in, in the input feature so we need to uh, input the surface here which is a digital elevation model in this case i have elevation surface so input the surface as elevation your uh, elevation surface and the lines will be the uh, line of sight created in this one our input feature will be the uh, obstruction uh, feature which is the view link in this case specify the output file location and the file name so you can simply run uh, this line of sight analysis to determine which uh, areas or which location along the road is visible from this to a uh, security personnel location or observation location see uh, new line of sight uh, or line of sight is added to the map layer as you can see here you can uncheck this one so uh, in this uh, new line of sight uh, output layer we have a line showing green and uh, red color and the green segment indicates that uh, the visible line of sight and uh, the red segment indicates that sites uh, lines that are uh, blocked by these building features so that means building that blocks an obstruction view of the portion of the road so as you can see this observer cannot see uh, through these buildings which is uh, this area is blocked so it shows that the lines are red similarly for this observer you can know the behind these buildings so it shows that the visibility is uh, blocked so it shows the red color if you check the attribute of this layer it shows uh, zeros in the ones on 
on this uh, on this field or this column we have zeros in the ones and the zeros means the red one which is uh, there is no uh, visible site and the one shows that the visible sites for uh, from this observer's location so just uh, by using this arcgis pro line of sight analysis you can select the suitable location to uh, locate security personnel or security camera uh, to by checking the intervisibility of the target in the observation uh, location analysis so this is all my road to this tutorial i'll see you in the next video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel goodbye